What is NEAR protocol? NEAR is a proof of stake layer one blockchain with a consensus mechanism called Nightshade. Cool name, right? What NEAR does is make it easier for developers to build and interact with blockchain applications. Some of its claims to fame include being user-friendly, carbon neutral, scalable. It has token incentives and a rainbow bridge that allows it to move between various blockchains, so it bridges over. NEAR's mainnet launched in April 2020, so it's not a new project and it's had time to develop, including its dApps and its smart contracts. So it's more mature, it's more tried and true. NEAR was founded by Alex Skidanov and Ilya Polosunkin. Polosunkin previously worked at Google where he helped develop its artificial intelligence capabilities. Your protocol is considered an AI coin, which is a really hot narrative right now. If you were to Google top AI coins, Nier is up there as one of the best projects in that niche. My name is Crypto Andy. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Now that we understand what Nier protocol is, let's talk about its roadmap and price action. Nier has accomplished a lot this year, as reflected in good price action. One of the more notable accomplishments was Ethereum wallet support. What this improvement did was support wallets like MetaMask natively on Nier. That helped attract more users since they could just use their MetaMask wallet. After a certain point in being in the crypto space, you will wind up having a lot of wallets. So that integration is quite convenient. Trust me on that. Another improvement was a collaboration with Polygon. The ZK Wasm update helped build a prover for WebAssembly smart contracts. This helped create an alternative execution environment to Ethereum virtual machine for layer twos. In case you didn't know, Polygon is a top layer two. And if you want to learn more about them, click the link in the description. I did a deep dive on Polygon and you should watch that video. Seems like everyone is doing business with Polygon. They're that big. Another improvement Near had was support for account aggregations. This allowed users to control accounts on different chains with one near account, not to be confused with ETH wallet support. These are other chains I'm talking about. Probably the most technically challenging was the research into sharding. The choice being for heading in one of two directions, CK centric sharding, which leverages zero knowledge proofs to validate state transition and synchronous sharding, which enables synchronous execution of smart contracts but has the problem of dealing with asynchronous execution. The details of that are beyond the scope of this video, but once that choice is made, significant time and resources are spent to make it happen. What we can be sure of is that Nier's development and everything the team has done is reflected in the price action. They have developed it themselves and it shows. It shows in what they're worth. Now, let's talk about price bumps. On October 21st, 2023, the price of Nier was just under a dollar. By December 23rd, the price of Nier had skyrocketed to a high of over $4.61, a more than 4x move in two months. That's absolutely parabolic. The price then dropped 45% to under $2.53. That move is typical in the crypto market. People who don't know better get shaken out. Uh, maybe some people bought at the peak over $4, then it crashed hard. However, from January 23rd to April 5th, 2024, the price pumped again 265% to just under $9. These prices are just so crazy. From the first date of December 23rd to April 5th, the price pumped over 7X. Near has had great price action this whole year. Solana had a similar price pump to this. However, since the token price for Nier is so much lower, you would have made more money because you would have had more tokens. More tokens equals more earning, more earning equals more money. I don't know if people take that into consideration when they buy a cryptocurrency, and I wish that they would. Alexander Skidanov is a software engineer and entrepreneur. He is one of the co-founders of Nier, founding the project in 2017. Alexander serves as the CEO of the company. He is responsible for the strategy and visions of Near Protocol. He previously worked at Microsoft in 2009 and worked for a company called Change.org as a software developer. He has a deep understanding of blockchain technology. His opinion is respected in the field. Alexander definitely has a strong background. The other founder I want to talk about is Ilya Polosukin, also a software engineer. He serves as CTO of Near Protocol at a tech company 
the CTO is very important. Ilya is responsible for leading the technical development of Near Protocol. He has previously worked at Google and NVIDIA, so you know that he understands AI. He also has published numerous research papers on topics such as data storage and distributed systems. With guys like Alexander and Ilya, it's no wonder Nier is doing so fantastic. Those backgrounds are impressive. They have years of experience. This is all very bullish for Neo. It helps explain their continued success, specifically in AI. If you have made it to the end, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Crypto Andy channel. Thank you for watching.